festival, first group of top spinners ever to have more than 100 people throwing tops at a festival. That was back in 19, 2000, and that was pretty exciting, but it was over the course of a couple hours. Guinness didn't recognize it. The next year we went a little bit better. We had 150-some. Guinness didn't recognize it. A couple years went by, then we found out about Branson out there in St. Louis and Silver Dollar City. They contacted Guinness and Guinness says, we will recognize your record if everybody spins at the same time. So they got 250 people and some of them didn't work, some, but as it worked out, they had 193 and that was a record that went in the book for a while. Then, over in Hong Kong, at a Beyblades convention, 377 people got together and they each threw one Beyblade and Guinness recognized that as a record. So I started contacting Guinness and, you know, Mark will be happy to share some of his Guinness experiences. And, you know, they're back and forth, it's not the fastest, but finally I got word back from them because I said, we could do this or that. They said, no, you have to do 378 people. We're not interested in tops. Well, they are interested in tops, but you know what I'm saying. But we're we're limited somewhat in Miamisburg, not being the biggest metropolitan area. But we do have diehard top spinners who can spin more than one at a time. So we came up with this idea after finding these finger spinners that work so well that Mark liked them so well that he used them on his stage show in New York City to break a number of records. And so we got came up with this idea we could each do 10 or 15 or 20. And so that's where we are today, and Mark is here after a successful run, sold out, almost every performance. Four weeks, sold out. <laughs> Unbelievable story, you gotta, gotta look it up on the internet. Stunt Lab, he and his friend Jonathan go back and forth. It's all about them preparing for Guinness records and breaking them every night. Their goal is to break at least one record. And they did it pretty much every <laughs> Please, Mark, say a word while we're here in anticipation of resting our fingers. Wow. Is this the pep talk? If yes, that, yes. Uh, all right, so um, not everybody gets to do an official, real Guinness World Record. And we're going to set a world record here, which is going to be awesome. So uh, I think it's fantastic that everybody's here. And everyone's got their fingers warmed up. Hopefully we'll get out of here without, any, without too many blisters. And. Uh, Mike, what are you going to do to uh, start things off? Are you going to do uh, some sort of 3 two, one kind of thing? What? You know, I don't have any tops. I'm happy to do a 3 two, one but it was so neat that you were here. Here, now talk again. I wouldn't get anything out here. All right, so now we got two speakers. Can you guys now hear I it? sound like a big man. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I thought you hear better. And, uh, yeah, so I, I, with my buddy Jonathan, we set a bunch of world records in New York City, one of them including the tops that Mike provided me with. It was fantastic. I had to do it twice because I messed it up once. But uh, it was very exciting. We had the support of Miamisburg in New York City. Yay! New York City, that's us! We were in New York City! Famous. New York City! <laughs> All right, well, I think we should get it started. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm just so excited. I just couldn't pass that up. Okay, well, the good news is we have enough participation that I do not have to spin one top, but I can be the judge. And with the, as a pastor, you know, I'm not going to lie about what we did, so don't try to push the envelope on me. And you guys, you're already over there. You should not have any spinning top at this time. Yes. Do you want to have one person in each group? Yes. I, do we have enough people to count in each group? We have a spinner and we have a counter in each group. Can we do that? Caleb. I need, I need a counter. You want to be my counter? I would be honored to be your counter, Mark Hayward. You know, Kim Iser, did you hear about the theater? Is it opening downtown? I heard that they're going to have a show there. September 8th. What I'm frustrated about is that we were not contacted because we want to get Dale Schramm in there. 90 years old, he was singing on a little chair when he was like five and six years old. He should be back there. <coughs> Plus, a dream now that I've just kind of been harboring, batting around is, wouldn't it be neat if the stunt lab came to downtown Miamisburg and set a bunch of world records? I mean, yeah, it'd be so exciting. Okay, is everybody ready? No spinning tops, right? And is there a counter at each area? Or close, okay? You need a counter, Jacob? Okay, and a counter back there? 
We need a count. We are out of counters. Can you help count? Come on, help count. I see you count people in parade unit. You count me how many times I fall on the unicycle. You can count. Each person has 15. If they're all going, that's 15. That should be it. But we'll uh, we'll double check. We don't have exactly 15. This Okay, I'll go around right after this and we'll see how many we did. But right now the time is 5.23. We're ready for our first record attempt and we'll see how many we can get. 3.77 is the record. Get as many as you can go. What? I'll do 3, 2, 1, start and we'll give you a minute. And if you get all everything spinning, why don't you yell or raise your hand. And how many groups do we have? We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twenty-nine again. I can't. I lose track after. But it looks like that. 